Hello everybody, it's your boy QC. So, as you don't know, but maybe have seen on my channel, I do like playing some Crash Team Racing. And nowadays, we just got done with the Halloween event, Nina's uh, Spook Tour. And you ask yourself, well, I spent a, a lot of coins on getting some of the stuff that I haven't gotten before the event was over, and now the new event, Neon Circus, which is going, going to be here on Friday, November 8th, I don't have enough. So I'm here to show you that how to, what to deal with, how, what to start when you get enough coins to buy stuff. Now with every CTR Nitro Grand Prix, you get cosmetics like skins for your characters, maybe um, different colors for your cart, some stickers, um, wheels and everything. So I'm trying to give you some little bit of hints on what to do first. Now, if you have enough money, let's say you saved, you got all the cosmetics from the past Grand Prix and you want to build up to the next one. And if you did, you build up like maybe for me, I'm close to 50,000 coins, right? I have enough. So when the new event comes out, let's say it's like day one of the event, they got little bundles. Like you have character bundles on one section, then you have a cart. Sometimes they'll have the carts, the cart bundles and stuff. If you have like enough money, usually they cost about like 5,000 or maybe 4,000 based on either you have the character from the past event, let's say it was uh, Tana Bandicoot. If you unlocked her from the first Nitro Squad Grand Prix, which was Twilight, Te Twilight, Twilight Tour, you are, you, it gets a little discount, like it's m minus maybe 5%. Then you only then you got the cosmetic for the current Grand Prix, the color for your cart, and the wheel. Sometimes they'll also have a sticker if it's not if there's not a wheel or a color thing for it. Then you could be able to buy it. Buying those bundles can really help because now you don't have to, you know, wait day between day and day and day for the new stuff to hit the pit shop. Back when it was the Spooky Tour, you had Brio, you had Komodo Mo, Kom, uh, Komodo, Komodo Mo, excuse me. Uh, I believe it was uh, Humpty Dumpty Ent Entrance and Witch Tana. Four characters who had the characters themselves. Um, the skin, the the color for the cart, and I don't think, and sometimes they have the wheel. It's a good bundle, it will unlock what you need, which also can help you for your Nitro gauge. Because when you play online or you play on the local online arcade thing, it will have a gauge after you finish and a couple of tasks that you have completed. and. The more of the stuff that you need, which will have a green little gauge on your, on next to the cosmetic, either a wheel, character, so on, and so on, it will help build up that gauge. So, first day for me, usually I'm from a finished bronze all the way to maybe half silver, because you got the special tasks that you can do, and it really helps build it up. So, the closer you're done with the nitro gauge. The close that you're part of the top five percent to get the cosmetic champion cart that w that is going to be represented in the uh, Grand Prix. So let's say you don't have enough coins and you have to build up. Let's say you got maybe four thousand. Here's the thing: do not start. Don't don't go buy the bundle. Okay, wait. Build up your coin stash. Now, let's say you don't want to do that. You got enough money in your P in your PS PlayStation whatever. And you say, "Hmm, 
I'll do whatever I want and do some micro micro transactions transaction you can do that I'm not judging you nobody is judging you do what you want to do okay live your life then you can do that for the people who don't want to do that build up you want to build as much as you can so let's say you can't you don't have enough to buy the big bundle but you see there's a character in the pit stop that you want and it also has a little nitro gauge and you want either the skin or the character itself. Build up your stash, maybe get close to maybe I want to say 7,000 because usually the characters are 2,500. Then you can buy it. First start off with the characters. That doesn't mean you know you need to have you could buy the bundle. You know if you want to buy the bundle, build up because they will appear all every day from the 8th of November all the way to the 8th of December. So you got a whole month of time to get the char get the character, get the skins, get the wheels, whatever. So week one, get the characters or get the skins. You know, Pat, you want Pasadena? Boom, you got it. You want Koala Kong? He's gonna be in the Grand Prix Nitro Gauge. Never mind. Uh, Varnek, you can grab him. You want the cosmetics for the Nitro Girls? Go get them. On that one week, build up your stash and then get every character that you can. Usually, not all the characters are gonna come by. It's gonna wait a day. So, buy a character day one, then day two, build up your stuff, get another character. Day three, day four, and so on, so on. So that's week one. Week two. Now, after you get all the characters and everything situated, now you got the carts. Now, the carts. There, I think there's two of them, and no, there's one cart that's gonna be able to buy. While there's two other carts that's gonna be unlockable in the uh, nitro gauge section, which is the bronze, gold, and silver. Now, the wheels are important because it helps build up that gauge, like I said. So, week two, get the wheels. Now, the wheels will also cost 2500 so be able to um, build up, like I said, with the characters. Now, you have week two. Keep doing the same process. You want to buy each wheel. Sometimes there's more wheels within the week, so save up and get some more wheels. Now, I don't know if you care about the stickers so well, but if so, it could wait about, I want to say, the last week of the tour. So, you got the skins for the characters, you got maybe the new characters, now you got the wheels and everything, you got the carts maybe. Now, you have enough to start building up for the next Grand Prix. Like I said. You want to start off with the characters first, because they cost $2,500. Then, you want to start with the wheels that also cost $2,500. Now, getting those two things out of, out of the way, you could build up, and also you can save yourself some coinage. So you could be well prepared for the Christmas event, for December, for Nitro Car. So anyway guys, I thought maybe I'll share two cents with you. Maybe you already know about how to save money. What should I know? But I thought maybe you want to hear some stuff from about that. Anyway, it's your boy QC. I'll catch you next time.